when we would see dips and we talked about Oh, this thing's dead, for sure. Players just seem to either come back or we find new players. I don't know how. Which is crazy, like we're at six years now and we continue to celebrate it. So we started off Hyper Hippo with one big vision project and then learned we weren't listening to the audience. We didn't get feedback. One of our values is player first and a lot of that doesn't get talked enough. What player first would mean is, is we're here to build a great experience for the player. The longevity of Adventure Capitalist more than anything has validated that approach. This game is soft. It's meant to be like a plushie or something that you can just hug and, and feel good about, right? It's all about listening to the audience and you know, if something's not important to them, don't bother with it. It's funny just how much of, a, of an emotional connection you can create with your fans, even through something as silly as ad cap. In the video game industry, we're a lot more like running a submarine. A whole bunch of crew, we're in it, we're under the water. We actually can't see anything and we're using all our equipment to sonar and everything, our retention, our data, our analytics, everything, to figure out where we are in the water and to make a choice, to make a move forward. And it's a lot of times very, it's actually discouraging and sad because we don't see our fans. But when you do get to see them, it's so exciting. There was one super fan. He knew the game inside and out. John was actually um, one of our Steam players and he was really, really, really into AdCap. He pretty much updated all the wikis. And he could like really help us with giving us details on like, hey, this thing feels a little hard or this thing's not quite right. We actually ended up making an avatar of him right in the game as a manager. We mixed him with Neo from The Matrix. We called him Johnny O. Oh, what was his last name? Johnny O. Anderson. Oh man, that guy was a legend. I can count on probably two hands these fans that just sort of like understand maybe even the appeal of what you've made better than you do. It's amazing going to conferences and stuff and how many people run up to you and know what Adventure Capitalist automatically is. GDC 2015, that was a new experience for me in the in the entertainment industry because I was there, Lance and I were, walked around the floor together and we had this vest on. All of a sudden a crowd would gather around. They just come up, they just come right line up. They're so excited to show their phone and their progress. Wow, Adventure Capitalist, can I show you my game? And then you go a little bit further on your way back to your hotel, and then you'd have another crowd come up at the next corner. Idol went through like a renaissance because of like uh, because of our team and what, what we were willing to try. It was Apple who actually came up with the, uh, at that point. That was the first time that I had seen Idol as being a description that they used as sort of an industry standard of what this genre was going to be called. I know that there were other sort of clicker games, but I think this is sort of the first one that had that mass appeal because everybody loves money. It has made everything else possible that we're doing right from the beginning. They were pretty much at the brink of kind of closing down, closing the doors. We sort of had at this six month ultimatum um, where we needed to find some sort of audience and we did. Adventure Capitalist at its core is like a magic eight ball for, for dad jokes and puns. Like you shake it up and then you read it and you go. Great poop on the sick. I like to say that I'm the creator of it, but the truth is that there were so many people involved to make it a success. Take the uh, the skills and the leadership of somebody like Tristan, and then you take the horsepower of, of people like uh, James uh, Brotherston and Kevin Yaki, and the artwork of Kale Atkinson was just out of this world. Thank you to anybody that played the game, anybody that uh, spent time enjoying it. Uh, even if you hated it, thanks for giving it a look. Gosh, thank you for everything. Thank you for changing my life. Uh, thank you to everyone that's, that made the game better. Thanks to everyone who played, who played the game. AdCap has been the story of how we went from our own really rags to riches um, experience as Hyper Hippo. I hope it's brought some joy to you. It's meant a lot to me and uh, it'll forever be uh, uh, one of the proudest accomplishments of Hyper Hippo, so thank you.